Hi, my name is Sheila and today I'll be walking you through the Financial Risk Manager FRO workshop. Let's start with the agenda. The agenda has seven items. We'll start with the introduction to GARP and the FRM program. Next, we'll move on to job roles and professions suited for the FRM designation. Followed that, we'll discuss the benefits of the FRM designation. Next, we'll look at the steps on achieving the FRM certificate. That includes three parts. First, registering for the FRM designation. Second, the course of study. And third, the costs associated with the exam and deadlines. Then we'll talk about the challenges in preparing for the FRM examination. Next, we'll discuss overcoming study challenges. And we'll finally conclude with EDGE course details. Let's begin. GARP. The Global Association of Risk Professionals was founded in 1996. It is a non-profit association for financial and energy risk certifications. GARP has set the gold standard in studies for risk management through independence, expertise, and leadership. The FRM program. The FRM examination set by GARP is a globally recognized certification and a benchmark qualification for professionals in the fields of risk management. The FRM helps in attaining practical knowledge in the fields of financial, operational, and enterprise risk. The designation increases opportunities for professionals and distinguishes them as individuals who are able to master complex, real-world challenges. Let's take a look at the job roles and professions that pursue the FRM designation. Here is a sample list of job titles for which FRM is a key skill. We have highlighted a few job titles which are popular amongst the candidates who seek the FRM certification. These are just a few samples. Of course, there's an extensive list for you to go through. Having reviewed the job roles, let's see how the FRM program can benefit you. Educational Enhancement The FRM program prepares candidates for a holistic and practical understanding of risk management, a skill necessary to succeed in the financial services industry. Career Enhancement Other than being able to take an exam in English, the FRM program has no educational or experience prerequisite. Thus, the candidate can accelerate their careers no matter their professional or academic background. Networking. GARP provides a lifelong platform to the world's most prominent risk management professionals, expanding opportunities within the world of finance. Leadership skills. Completing the rigorous requirements for the designation represents a commitment to professional excellence, significant to the profession, positioning you as a leader in the risk management field and global recognition. With FRM candidates in more than 100 countries over the world, the designation's acknowledgement, career and professional development has increased vastly over the years. And that brings us to the steps to achieving the FRM designation. Registration and preparation in four simple stages. Stage one, log on to the GARP website and register for the FRM program. Stage two, Pay the one-time enrollment fee and the examination fee for the relevant part or parts of the exam you will be sitting. Step 3. Review the set curriculum diligently for a period of 3 to 4 months. And then the last step. Pass both examinations within the 4-year time period. Moving on to the course of study. The FRM program comprises of two parts. FRM Part 1 covers the fundamental tools and techniques used in risk management and the theories that underlie their use. Specific areas of coverage of the exam and their waiting areas are as follows. Foundations of risk management, which is 20% of the portion. Quantitative analysis, which is also 20% of the portion. 
financial markets and products, which represents 30% of the exam. And lastly, valuation and risk models, which represents 30% of the exam. FRM Part 2 is more about the applications of the tools and techniques covered in Part 1. It involves a deeper study into the major areas of risk management. The areas of coverage include credit risk, market risk, operational risk, each having a 25% weightage. Part 2 also includes investment risk management for a 15% portion and current issues in financial markets for a 10% exam portion. Current issues are selected journals and articles handpicked by GARP to keep today's professionals informed on the recent market developments and budding risks. And now we're moving on to the FRM exam format. The FRM Part 1 and Part 2 exams are offered twice a year, specifically on the third Saturday of May and November. Both exams are paper-based, and the test is made up of multiple choice questions. As discussed earlier in the topic of study, Part 1 consists of the fundamental tools and techniques, whereas Part 2 talks deeper into the major areas of risk management. The FRM Part 1 exam is four hours long, and this consists of 100 multiple choice questions. Candidates have a little less than two and a half minutes to attempt each question. FRM Part 2, on the other hand, is also four hours long, but has 80 multiple choice questions, giving candidates three minutes per multiple choice question. Here are the exam fees and deadlines. Under all cases, candidates have to pay the one-time enrollment fee of $400. However, depending on how soon you register for the exam, the exam fees can vary. GARP has three deadlines for the exam. Early registration, which is usually three and a half months before the exam, where the exam fee is only $350. Standard registration, which closes two and a half months before the exam, and the exam fee rises to $475. And late registration, which closes one month before the exam, which is the last opportunity to register for the exam window at a cost of $650. The FRM exam is truly a global one. GORP offers 100 exam sites around the world, making it easier for candidates to select an exam venue most convenient to them. Edge Education Training Center is located in Dubai, United Arab Emirates. Edge Education's trainers have guided students for the FRM exam for over four years and counting. Here are a few challenges and remarks cited by candidates and certificate aspirants studying with Edge Education. And if you've commenced your studies, I'm sure some of these challenges will resonate with you. 300 hours of study time is recommended by GORP. I don't have that much time. I only have 2 minutes, 24 seconds to read, understand, and correctly answer each MCQ. The global pass rate for the May 2017 exam for part 1 was 42% and for part 2, 54%. What are my chances of passing? I need to target 70% score to pass. That is tough. Different study materials. Which one should I follow? How can I apply bookish concepts to exam day questions? The concepts are abstract. How can I apply them to practical situations at work? Mastering this calculator is difficult. Balancing work and studies is challenging. Let's look at some of the solutions offered to candidates by Edge Education. In regards to the 300 hours of study, we say that Edge class trainings cover over 130 hours in classroom. To combat the time crunch, Edge Classroom examples and online portal questions offer ample practice so that you develop the needed speed and accuracy. Edge progress trackers and mock tests give you an idea of how the concepts are likely to be tested on the exam day. We understand that the pass rates hover around the 50% mark, which is why, in the event a candidate studies with Edge and does not pass, Edge offers a pass protection scheme 
which allows you to retake the training for no additional cost. Terms and conditions apply. No one said it was going to be easy, but with EDGE's comprehensive program, candidates follow a rigorous regimen laid out by our expert team, which comprises of certified FRNs. GARP's curriculum is a collection of required readings for the exam. In the classroom, EDGE students follow a series of lecture slides that condense the curriculum into a comprehensive guide and acts as a complement to the GARP prescribed readings. To help you understand the concepts better, EDGE's classroom training includes solving examples in class. With live discussions and debates, the classroom environment is kept lively and engaging. Candidates are permitted to carry any one of the exam-approved calculators to the test day. Mastery of this calculator requires a lot of practice and is often crucial to passing the exam. EDGE professors train candidates to the calculator's process until proficiency is achieved. Shortcuts, hidden functions, handy tips, we've got them covered. We understand studying for the exam is a balancing act. With family, work, social life, and studies, things can get out of control. EDGE offers classroom training on weekdays and weekends. With flexi training schedules, don't miss out on important life's events. And if you happen to get stuck at an event you can't skip, request the EDGE team for a copy of the classroom video recording and catch up at home. The final item for today's agenda, EDGE course details. EDGE Education is a training center in the United Arab Emirates. We offer preparatory training for FRM, the Financial Risk Manager Certification, CFA, the Chartered Financial Analyst Examination, as well as CMA, the Certified Management Accountant Examinations. EDGE Education offers the FRM Part 1 and Part 2 exam prep training in two formats, the professional course and the revision course. The professional course is taught by our full-time faculty who are certified FRMs. The course consists of 31 to 37 live classes which span 90 to 110 hours with the aim of covering each curriculum reading. The course also consists of four hours of one-on-one -on -one doubt clearing sessions with the FRM trainer. Edge Education's special study notes and study aids are also part of the package. The program also includes progress tracking, which are regular exam-style assessments in class, as well as 300-plus practice questions on the EDGE online portal. Students are provided with the free Texas BA2 Plus calculator, as well as the Pass Protection Scheme, which was mentioned earlier. Candidates are also given access to a quiet study area equipped with computers and workstations. EDGE Education's revision course includes five intensive exam-focused review classes, which span 40 instructor training hours. The course also includes two hours of one-on-one -on -one training. These personal sessions can be used to clear up doubts or to review troubled topic areas. The course includes a revision workbook with 250 plus questions, as well as a formula booklet. The revision course is concluded with a four-hour mock exam and a review session. Candidates are also provided with access to study rooms. I hope you found this demo helpful. If you have any additional questions or wish to know more about our courses and pricing plans, please contact the EDGE Education's admin team. You can speak to us or WhatsApp us or email us or visit our website. Thank you.